the biggest achievement uh, personally was being able to play in the Rose Bowl. Uh, all the uh, individual stuff was really irrelevant, but being able to play with uh, my team and the guys and get along and play for a national championship you know, was uh, probably the biggest accomplishment. We were there to play football. That was our sole purpose was to win. And we, we had a chip on our shoulder. But uh, we went through that season and we, we meant to pound people. We wanted to make a statement. We knew what we were capable of. We were uh, a lot of no-star recruits. I don't even know if they had stars back then, but just a very tight team accountable to each other and to coaching and just love to play football. We beat the Cal Bears at home to solidify a Rose Bowl. Then we went down to Arizona and put a drubbing on them, which was even better. One of the great iconic Sun Devil pictures is Keith Poole, you know, catching the, catching the touchdown, basically throwing it in you know, Kalish's face in the end zone. And we knew we played hard. We knew we had some talent. But, you know, above all, we, we earned it. We earned everything we got. So we felt, uh, you know, again, a chip on our shoulder going to the Rose Bowl, playing Ohio State. We knew the stakes were high. I was very fortunate to receive a scholarship. That was an accident to come to Arizona State. They weren't technically recruiting me. They were recruiting the guy I played with. And uh, my offensive line coach said, I don't want him, I want him. So it was pure accident that the film was sent and he noticed me on film and started the recruiting process. Truly honored to be inducted, first of all, and then uh, truly honored again that uh, a lot of close family friends from high school, childhood family friends uh, coming in. When I got the call, I was, I was immediately flattered, honored, but I immediately started thinking about my teammates, uh, the times we had, all the weight room antics, locker room antics, on the field antics, the good times that we shared that you can only do on a team for the guys that are, are you know, fighting, leading together and uh, doing those things. It was a hell of a good time. It's Arizona State. I, I, I wouldn't take anything back. It's, it's a great school. I wouldn't take anything back. My professional career, I was very fortunate in that. And I won two Super Bowls. 2001 with the New England Patriots. That was right after 9-11. Another underdog team that wasn't supposed to be there. Uh, much like our Arizona State team going to the Rose Bowl. No one really predicted it. And then proceeded to play for the Green Bay Packers, the New York Giants. And uh, won my second Super Bowl with the Giants actually here in Arizona against the Patriots who were 18-0. Huge underdog again. I have a soft spot for underdogs because I've been on those teams. Uh, I've been on the Super Bowl team, I've been on the 4-12 and team. And to experience the highs and lows throughout a season uh, is amazing. You know, I've, I've been to a championship game and lost in, in the Rose Bowl. So I think those experiences really help mold me as a player and a person to be able to play through those and take the lessons that I learned from coaches, family, and parents to get it done.